the Quran says that one of the things that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala expects from us is Allah asks us to observe justice. This is the first step. And secondly, al ihsan Not only we should observe justice, we should do good. A Muslim has to be beneficial and benevolent wherever he or she is, whether it's in a Muslim country or non-Muslim country, whether it's in family, in workplace, in university, a school, on the street, in the bus, everywhere we should be showing kindness, love, benevolence, charity to people. This is our responsibility. When we want to donate, we should donate something which is valuable and something we ourselves appreciate and value. By donation, we want to bring a change. We want to bring goodness to the society. So every time we should see what is needed, what can be most beneficial. One of the things that are normally always you can say needed is blood because there are so many accidents happening so many people you know are in need of operations surgery so we need to donate so that another fellow human being who is in need can benefit i would like to encourage everyone to take part in this important initiative especially when this blood donation is done in the name of Imam Hussein alayhi salam, this has added value because you are doing something good also in the name of a person that has great right over us because by giving his blood, blood of heart, blood of his best companions and members of the family, he ensure that today me and you are able to be on the right track on the right path so now giving our blood in the name of imam hussein salam, is one of the best things that we can do to show that we muslims are beneficial for the society and we are ambassadors of love and charity We believe that what Imam Hussein alayhi salam did was the best answer to the problem that existed in that society. When we say Kullu yawman ashura, it means that humanity is always suffering from injustice. And Imam Hussein's response to the problem that existed in the year 61 after Hijra is a common response. So every person now, as before and as in future, can learn from the example of Imam Hussein alayhi salam how to respond. We should follow the example of Imam Hussein alayhi salam by stressing on justice, on honor and dignity as necessary and fundamental right of every human being. So we, by giving our blood, by giving whatever valuable we have, we are trying to help people so that they can have a life of honor and respect and become again a member of their family, of their society, be productive, be healthy, be active. So we learn from Imam Hussein alayhi salam that we should have maximum respect for humanity especially for human dignity and inshallah i hope that we remember this lesson and we share this beautiful lesson with everyone else in the world